Dang, Clats! Now, I know this is a different location, right? For the first time ever, we're changing it up a little bit. But, today I'm bringing you guys to my kitchen because this is the first episode of Cooking with Clat. So I was thinking while I'm at home and when I'm taking a break of these trips, I might as well start a little series called Cooking with Clats, where I show you guys some of the random stuff I make in the kitchen or some recipes I already know and maybe some traditional foods around the world that I learned how to make. thought this would be a fun thing to do if you incorporate travel and food together and I love food, so let's get into it. So today, what I'm gonna be making is a nut Pasta. It's gonna consist of like spaghetti with coconut milk and assorted nuts on top of it And when you roast the nuts they come out very delicious So we're gonna make it in a stir-fry fashion. We might even add some little chili sauce. So let's get right into it Some ingredients you guys are gonna need is coconut milk Spaghetti doesn't matter what type for my selection I'm taking some dry roasted peanuts and then there's a couple mixed nuts that I'm just gonna filter out through there. You're gonna want a bit of brown sugar, and you might wanna get some hot, sweet, and sour sauce, so it has a little bit of spice to it. So the first step is obviously going to be to boil the spaghetti. So you're gonna turn your oven on high, and you are just gonna start breaking the spaghetti and putting it inside the water. Because this is gonna be just for me, I'm not making that much, so you know, just pick your spaghetti accordingly. Just make sure that all the pasta is completely covered in water. Um, make sure it's all the way high and then just let it start boiling. Now it's a crucial step. You see when the water starts bubbling, that means your water is boiling. So you're gonna put a little bit of salt in there so nothing sticks to the bottom. And you're gonna start stirring the pasta around or the spaghetti around. So it looks like the pasta is pretty much ready now. It's all see, soft and spaghetti-like. And uh, just keep stirring it around. Just make sure that all the pieces are nice and soft. Now this next step I like to do kind of fast. So I'm going to keep, the, I turned off the oven there, so I'm going to keep the pasta boiling on whatever heat's left. And for now, I'm going to turn on this part of the oven or the stove and have this start heating up, which is going to be our stir fry pan. And what I recommend is adding a little bit of oil. Doesn't matter what kind of oil, preferably canola or olive oil. And uh, just kind of move that around there. We're just gonna have this kind of heat up because I like, I like when I'm cooking to have heat transfer for one second. I really want the food to cool. And so now that this is cool, we're gonna go to our next step. Pour your spaghetti and water into the strainer. So make sure all the water is strained. Just you know, bounce it around a little bit. Make sure that all the water is out of there. We're just gonna drop everything we just strained into here. And you hear that sizzling? That's the oil and that mixing it together. Now we're gonna turn this down a little bit so it's not too hot. We don't wanna burn the pasta. I'll we'll just start mixing it around. Next we're gonna add about a, I think a cup of coconut milk, something like that. It's a good amount. We want it to get a really creamy consistency. It's kind of be like Alfredo, but with coconut. <laughs> oh God, that smells so good. Wow, that smells really, really good. Okay, so now we're gonna turn the heat even higher back on. I would put it even up to the highest if you can. And so now, if I was in your position, I would start sifting through the several different nuts that you wanna throw in there. Start organizing what type of nuts you wanna put in there. I have the peanuts already organized, but I'm kinda getting walnuts and almonds, um, some macadamia nuts. So once you got like a good amount of nuts, you just plop them in there, just kinda spread them around, even it out. You're gonna wanna make sure everything is stirring around and it's all delicious and delicious. The next step is to take about a tablespoon of brown sugar. So get around a tablespoon of brown sugar and just kinda go like that. Get it, try to get it evenly around. Now to give it a tad bit more flavor, I'm just adding, you know, like little pinches of, uh, of frozen veggies. This just adds, and it gives you kinda like a surprise in every bite. And now just for an added, Bonus, I just saw that I have these. I'm just gonna sift some coconut pieces on top. This is really, you don't have to do this at all. I just thought it'd be a cool idea to put it on. We're just gonna add some pepper. Some delicious pepper. Give it a peppery little taste. Just gonna move that to the side, let it cool down, and when it's done cooling off, you can serve it. And viola, it's done. Now our delicious coconutty spaghetti is done. The thing I like about this is it's so simple and you can taste like really every flavor that you put in it. 
You taste the vegetables and the nuts, and the coconut has a really subtle flavor. If you like this video, leave a like, comment down below, tell me if you guys want more of these, or if you guys hated it, I won't make any more. We got a really cool Halloween video coming out on Friday, so I will see you guys then. Later, plants!